Ah. Hear ye, hear ye. Seriously, got her comeuppance. She didn't see that shit come, and she was just talking shit to Marjorie. Oh my gosh. She in that, you know, she in that cell right now, looking like a mess. I, I bet no time has even passed. Twenty four hours has probably passed. She looking crazy. She, she looking like this, a hot ass mess, it, disheveled, dilapidated. Come on now looking crazy i know she is in that cell because she just got her hair did i know she did i know she got she, her hair was looking all wavy they took that hot ass curling iron to or it was extensions that kind of looked like extensions i don't know she looking crazy now i know she is just like marjorie I mean, she got her dress on marjorie had on nothing but rags so she still got her riches all right, let's get right into it. I dread any time I feel like we're gonna watch Sansa. It, it just hurts my heart, brother. How do I know you are who you say you are? If only I were otherwise. <laughs> you are Tyrion Lannister. Why shouldn't I kill you? To pay your family back for what it did to mine. You want revenge against the Lannisters? I am the greatest Lannister killer of our time. So I should welcome you into my service because you murdered members of your own family. Into your service? Your Grace, we have only just met. <laughs> it's too soon to know if you deserve my service. I like I that. Returned to the fighting pits. Told me that this girl, without wealth, lands, or armies, had somehow acquired all three in a very short span of time, along with three dragons. He thought she was our best, last chance to build a better world. Thought you were worth meeting at the very least. <laughs> Why are you worth meeting? Why should I spend my time listening to you? Because you cannot build a better world on your own. When I served as Hand of the King, I did quite well with the latter, considering the king in question preferred torturing animals to leading his people. <laughs> I could do an even better job. Advising a ruler worth the name. If that is indeed what you are. So you want to advise me? He wants to better the realm. Very well. What would you have me do with him? Oh my, I don't even know that nigga. <laughs> I would have... I know. Why should the people trust a queen who can't keep her promises? Mercy. Whoever Sir Jorah was when he started informing on you, he is no longer that man. I can't remember ever seeing a sane man as devoted to anything as he is to serving you. And yet he did betray you. Did he have an opportunity to confess his betrayal? Yes. And did he? No. Ask you questions, I love that. I'm still forced to do so. What's the context? He worships you. He is in love with you, I think. <laughs> but he did not trust you with the truth. An unpleasant truth, to be sure, but one of great significance to you. He did not trust that you would be wise enough to forgive him. So I should kill him. A ruler who kills those devoted to her is not a ruler who inspires devotion. <laughs> You're going to need to inspire devotion. A lot of it. If you are ever going to rule across the narrow sea. That's facts. But you cannot have him by your side when you do. Well, wow. remove Sajora from the city. He got one more time to be over here. <laughs> Y'all see him cross that street? What did you expect, Jora? At least you're alive. That nigga got lucky twice. <laughs> if I was, or if if a fucked up person was Tyrion, they could have been like, "Yo, he hit me like three times, bro. I don't fuck with him." No, I think he only hit Tyrion once, but no, like that's this is fair. I mean, honestly, oh yeah, that they confess again, low key. <laughs> he had another chest to say, "I'm dying," like that. Nah, but uh, yeah, it is what it is. At least you're alive, bro. Confess. Let me speak to them. Wow. Confess. Fuck. Lamented. My face will be the last thing you see. God, bopping the shit out of her. Tom and Dill lost his wife, his mom. He don't got his. <sighs> My name is Lana. 
I'm an orphan. I made enough money to buy two more. <laughs> wow. It took a while. But wow. I finally saved enough to buy myself an oyster cart. It makes sense that you'd have to become a good and the bakers. liar if you're going to take the identity of someone else. It's pretty cool. She will turn right and go to Ragman Harbor. What will she do there? She will see. Wow, this is crazy. How can a man tell a girl this? If he knew what she would see, there would be no reason to send her. That shit's so nasty to me. It's my 18th voyage. Returned from all of them without a scratch on me. Can't do it. Please. I've three children. Without me. Here, take it. You have to. I've three children. He wagers that a sailor's ship will make it to its destination. It is a strange wager for the captain. He only wins if he loses his life. What? So why would a captain make the wager in the first place? If the captain dies, the thin man pays his family a lot of money. Ah. But a destitute woman and her small child. What can they do to such a man if he keeps their money for himself? To whom can they turn for recourse? A faceless man? Or the many-faced god? My fault. The many-faced god. She will watch the gambler. She will come to know as much about him as she knows about herself. A gift. For the thin man. I'm not gonna lie, I'm so confused. Was she actually seeing the memories of... I thought that was the whole story she had to make up to, you know... You know. She's not ready. Perhaps she is, perhaps she's not. And if she's not? It is all the same to the many-faced God. So I guess this is actu an actual hit she has to carry out on dude and pretend to be Lana. I Who the fuck is the many-faced God? I assumed it was the Lord of Light, but is it completely separate? Well, part of me assumed it was death as well. The charges? Fornication, treason, incest, the murder of King Robert. All lies. Of course, you're However, I hope you'll excuse me for saying it, but belief is so often the death of reason. I wish you'd said it sooner. <laughs> your Grace, Grand Maester Pycelle. He ain't the Grand Maester, is he? Still? Has summoned your uncle Kevan back from Casterly Rock to serve as Hand of the King. He now presides over the small council. Tell him I need to speak to him. I implored him to visit you, but he would not. Wow. What about myself? Kyburn trying. If you can visit me, then surely the king. He remains in his chambers. His servants often find his food in the hall, left untouched. You oh my to God, Tom and blows. You need to talk to my son and tell him to come and see me. Come and see his mother. He, I tried, Your Grace. He wouldn't see me. He wouldn't see <laughs> that nigga sucks. I'm sorry, Your Grace. He can't stay. Is away. You might have to wake up Frankenstein or Frankenstein's monster. Confess. Oh. I rose him up from. Goodbye, my queen. Damn. She said, Time's up. The work continues. He ain't alive yet. She getting there, spasming more and more each day. Why, Theon? Not Theon. There is no Theon. There's the reason right there. You wanted to escape. There is no escape. Theon Greyjoy. You are trying. I bet you think I could have gotten out of there, but cut away piece after piece until there was no Theon left. Good. If it weren't for you, I'd still have a family. If I could do what Ramsay did to you right here, right now, I would. Is he gonna say that he didn't kill the he didn't kill her brothers? Everything. I deserve to be weak. Okay, maybe not. Killed those boys. They weren't those boys. They were Bran and Rickon. They were your brothers. You've known them since they were born. They weren't. They were lonely. Only what? I can't. Tell me. I can't. Not. Should be gone while you still breathe the air. Tell me to my face, Theon. Tell me that they weren't your brothers. They weren't Bran and Rickon. I couldn't find them. It was too far, boys. Do you know where they went, Bran and Rickon? I can't talk to you anymore. Theon, you have to tell me. Do you have any if idea? If I'm Reek, I'm hightailing it. 
He's Reek. I'm high telling it out. <laughs> Reek. <laughs> I've said enough. Our walls have been fully repaired. We have enough food for six months. We are more prepared for a siege than they could ever be. You disagree. Stannis isn't from the north. You are, father. I think you're missing an opportunity to show the people of the north how House Bolton treats southern invaders. But we hit first and hit hard. A smart commander does not abandon a defensive advantage. That's what I'm thinking. As long as we stay behind these walls, they can't touch us. I don't need an army. I need 20 good men. God damn, I fucking hate this dude, but he cleaned. <sighs> Whether I'm worthy of your service. <laughs> have you decided this is a duel right here. Going to have me killed? I'd say his thoughts on having me killed were abundantly clear. Is that why you killed him? No. Someday, if you decide not to execute me, I'll tell you all about why I killed my father. Two terrible children of two terrible fathers. I'm terrible. I was going to say, why you call her terrible? Stories. Mm. Why did you travel to the far side of the world to meet someone terrible? To see if you were the right kind of terrible. Which kind is that? The kind that prevents your people from being even more so. Mm. For 20 years, the spider oversaw the campaign to find and kill me. He did what he had to do to survive. He did a lot of other things as well, things he didn't have to do. He may be the only person in the world I trust, except my brother. The brother who killed my father? That's the one. Perhaps I will have you killed after all. Your queenly prerogative. <laughs> I love this. Life. Until Varys convinced me you might be worth living for. You chop off my head. Well, my final days were interesting. <laughs> I'm not going to kill you. Duh. Nigga too clean. So if I'm not going to be murdered and I'm not going to be banished. You're going to advise me. While well, you can still speak in complete sentences. Ah! <laughs> the Iron Throne. Perhaps you should try wanting something else. <laughs> if I want jokes, I'll get myself a proper fool. I'm not entirely joking. Perhaps this is where you belong, where you can do the most good. When you get back to your home, who supports you? The common people. Let's be generous and assume that's going to happen. <laughs> Here in Slaver's Bay, you had the support of the common people, and only the common people. What was that like? Ruling without the rich. House Targaryen is God, gone. Tyrion's so a good, man. The person who shares your blood is alive to support you. Stannis Baratheon won't back you either. His entire claim to the throne rests on the illegitimacy of yours. <laughs> that leaves the Tyrells. Lannister, Targaryen, Baratheon, Stark, Tyrell. Damn, she caught all that? spokes on a wheel. Hmm. On and on it spins, crushing those on the ground. It's a beautiful dream. Stopping the wheel. I'm not going to stop the wheel. I'm going to break the wheel. Okay. Interesting. Damn. Y'all sparring, right? That nigga swinging. You said whoever wins will fight to the great pit in front of the queen. I won. I mean, he already got grayscale, so fuck it. It makes you happy, but I'm the best you've got. That's facts. Let me fight for her, and I belong to you. Thirsty? Confess? She thirsty as hell. I can make you a wealthy woman, a lady of the court. Confess? Or I can make sure you die in the most hideous way imaginable. And all I do is sit here imagining hideous ways for you to die. That's a confession. As soon as she leave, I'm licking that up off the floor. I'm not even playing with you. I'm not even joking a little bit. As soon as she leave, I'm, I'm, bruh, you got me twisted. Oh my God. <laughs> I was going to say I was playing, <laughs> but I wasn't, I wasn't though. I, you have to, in this situation, you have to. That's crazy. You okay. You okay, buddy. Who's there? Ollie. Come in. Oh, slow. Ali! What happened? I need to check on baby Sam. A little Michael Jackson lean. Now then, how can I help? So why is he saving him? 
Just like us, there are good ones and bad ones. The one with the red beard. He led the raids on my village. Oh, Ollie. How can he trust him? I've seen the White Walkers, and they come in for us. But what if we let the wildlings through the gates and they cut our throats while we sleep? John's taking a risk, but he has to. We don't yeah, or we die. Otherwise. Right. Sometimes a man has to make hard choices. Choices that might look wrong to others, but you know are right in the long run. You believe that? With all my heart. I hope Ollie don't take that the wrong way and do something fucking insane. Nah, he take it too hard. I would be like, uh, hold up. Uh, hold up, Ollie. Holy shit. Ollie might do something crazy. I don't know. All right, John, we with you now. Let's go, John. He clean. He got it on, don't he? Yeah, he got it on. Wow. There are other wildlings. I'll bring them too. Not just Tormund. Because if I'm a wilding and I see just Tormund with y'all, I'm thinking, I never really knew Tormund like that. Why y'all? I don't know. I'd be like, why Tormund with them? Hold on. Greetings. You trust me, John Snow? Fuck no. But talk. <laughs> <Does> <laughs> that make me a fool? We're fools together now. Right. Oh, y'all walk in. Throw them? I thought y'all were going to start talking from right there. Lord of Bones. Lord of Bones. I forgot about this guy. Been a long time. Clean. What is he? We're allies. You fucking traitor. I was going to say, you choose that word? I'd be like, uh, look. <laughs> it's awkward. It's weird to explain. And when you're done talking, do you get down on your knees and suck his cock? There we go. Oh, yeah. There we go. He beating the spine out that man. Damn! He ain't fucking playing with y'all. <laughs> Gather the elders and let's talk. That's Torment Giants Bane. Y'all stop playing with him like he's somebody else. He beat that man to death. That's your Lord of Bones? Beat like that in front of everybody? Torment's him. He's that guy. Fucking playing with him. Uh, Mance who? I only recognize one man. Let's not let me stop. <laughs> Man, that's crazy, though. This is about putting a 700-foot wall between you and what's out there. Beat the White Walkers. Run from them, maybe. It's not a trick. It's a bomb! <laughs> it's a gift. That, all right. For those who join us, the man of the Night's Watch used one of these daggers to kill a walker. And with the things we've seen, you don't believe them? That's what I'm thinking. Come with me and I'll share these weapons. After if wargs exist, I believe everything else. The wall. The like, watch will let you through the tunnel and if I'm here. People. If if you swear you'll join us when the real war begins. Where is Mans? Yikes. <laughs> he died. Oh. Huh? Killed him. I put an arrow through his heart. <laughs> Hey, you know John looking at that giant like commander back to Castle Black. Wanted to burn him alive to send us a message. Jon Snow defied that Khan's orders. His arrow was mercy. What he did to courage. And that's what we need today. The courage to make peace with men we've been killing for generations. I'm not asking you to forget your dead. I'll never forget mine. Mm. To think about your children now. Right. Oh well, my gosh. Their own if we don't band together. The long night she main coming. character, you can already tell. I thought that was Tormund. That must be his dad. That nigga looked just like him. You vouch for this man, Tormund. He's preacher than both my daughters. This nigga he knows how to fight. He came because he needs us. And we need him. My ancestors would spit on me if I broke bread with a crow. So would mine, but fuck them, they're dead. She gotta be main character. She's survivor for at least a season. What's up? I'll never trust a man in black. What'd you say? If you say this is the way, we're with you. It sounds like Torment should be an elder. I'm with Torment. We stay here. We're dead men. Of course you're with them. You're his this dad. King Crow. There's a chance. King Crow's fire. Die, boy. 
Keep that new life you want to give us. As soon as you get on his ships, we're gonna slit your throats and dump your bodies to the bottom of the ship. Whatever, cannibal. This, to be fair, this would be a fire plan if John was gonna kill them. This would be a great plan. <laughs> I would have been like, John, why didn't you do this before? You know, if I was. I fucking hate things. You know, right? Real talk, like Jor back then. If Jor did this, I would be like, this nigga Jor is a genius. <laughs> this, it just like killed them all at sea. Oh my gosh. I, I would be like, that's a crazy gamble. I hate Thins anyway. We don't want them them. Yeah. Yeah, she right. We're leaving too many behind. The free folk are stubborn. You know how long it took man's to band them together? Twenty fucking years. Fuck. Many, and there's nothing to hunt. They'll come around. Well, we got to give Stannis his fleet back, though. Oh, Lloyd, great. That was a couple of them. Is she their mom? I want to go with you. I need to get the old folks on the boats. I'm right behind you, I promise. This has to be heart wrenching for her. Because you really don't know. They could just kill you all and dump you over. I'd be freaking out. Well, now you gotta go. Don't sit the kids. You better not ask. You better not ask him. You're braver than me. The fuck you, looking at us crazy. <laughs> My fault, sir. The White Walkers. This is perfect timing. They got the dragon glass. They need the... Oh, this is perfect timing, actually. Wow. The whole lighting changed. Oh, shit. They're running. Oh, the way they're doing this is awesome. John always has the best scenes. Holy shit. They give John the movie quality stuff. Am I recording? Oh my gosh. Shut the gates. Oh, you're a hoe. Wow. I'm not getting closer. I know someone got like a 10 foot stick. Oh, you're looking through? Oh my gosh, you're crazy. <coughs> Excuse me. Wow, that was crazy. Did they all get turned just like that? They're strong as fuck, too. How do you waste the arrows on their hands? They're swimming now. They're going to be freezing in the water? They're like, get to them fucking ships. <laughs> that's it's crazy how that switches up so the things that got jo Jojen and were fighting Bran these guys look like that but oh no their eyes are white though I just know the guys that were trying to attack Bran they could kill them like normal but oh no okay so I guess no, because White Walkers, even the undead raised by White Walkers, have to be killed with fire or dragon glass, right? But I'm wondering if the skeleton guys that attack Mira and Bran and Hodor and all them, if they're completely separate from the White Walkers, because those guys could just be killed. They didn't have to be killed by fire. I don't know. I think I'm thinking about this too hard to be honest with you. Yeah, facts. This nigga said it's on sight then. Wow. I would have been like, y'all hear something? I don't know. If the ships are this way. <laughs> but wow, they're ready. Damn, they in the wind. Jesus. Oh my god. Wow. They're, they're moving it fast forward. Three Stooges type shit. Look at this. Look at this. Okay, yeah. That for sure does the kill. Oh my goodness. So what are they about to do? Oh my, John, that was so clean. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. This camera movement is tiring out my eyes. 
My goodness. So if you do enough bodily harm, you can just kill them. I guess. Those are the big kahunas, the actual White Walkers. Y'all better save him. There we go. There we go. Ed was in here, right? Where the glass at? Holy shit. You know how hard it is? Oh, that effect is awesome. He says a little toasty in here, huh? Cool off. Wow. What the fuck? Damn. Yeah. I didn't think he'd die so quick, though. But I guess these, they different. We haven't really seen him fight. Damn. But we know they're strong after what they did to Sam, so. He bobbing and weaving, though. Fuck. Fuck. I know he woozy after that. He can't breathe. He got the wind knocked out. Yelp. Yup, yup. Where's everyone else? Holy shit. But maybe I hear, but he didn't get any of the dragon glass. Maybe he did. Maybe he snuck it to his uniform. But out here, everyone can see him kill the White Walker if he has it. Val it can't break Valyrian steel? Nigga, please tell me you caught that on video. <laughs> Did someone see it other than you? That makes sense. Oh, you done caught the eyes of him. So, Dragon Glass and Valyria. So, I guess because they're both like from Dragon stuff. <laughs> oh, my God. That one doesn't even have eyes. Oh my god. Why do I even care? Why do I even... Oh, he he's calling him off? Never mind, the opposite. I really thought she was gonna be a main character. I was like, she seemed cool, she seemed smart, beautiful, like of course she's gonna stick around. She gets eaten by children, undead children. Wait, what? Okay. Wow. I mean, he did not just headbutt a skeleton. He different. What's up? What's up? Gotta go, gotta go. I can't believe old girl died. That's. <laughs> huh. They gotta kill him. He's too strong. They're hustling. And I know John got a concussion. How y'all gonna get the giant on the boat? Nah, that giant's fucked. You just gonna walk it? You better tear them off. He coming along? Is he gonna push the boat? Oh, we're good! Okay, we got big bro. We got big bro. That's huge. Damn. At least they fucking tried, man. Real talk. This the main one, right? This the one that was... That turned the baby that we saw? What you looking at? Is he gonna freeze the water? Oh, um, maybe he just flexing. Oh, he's raising the fucking dead right in front of him, right in front of them. This dude is different. That's crazy. That's crazy to look at. He can do it just like, oh my gosh. Wow. That's crazy. He said, I'm like that. If there is any doubt, please let it be erased from your memory. He's him. He can just do that like that? That's way too OP. 
how did these niggas die the first how did they lose really the first time any battle they win is just more people on their side that's crazy He's like that, bro. My head dead ass hurts. The camera movement was insane. It was so much rapid movement. I'm starting to get hot. I know y'all say y'all don't like this. And to be fair, the first two episodes, because of the way I had to record in the footage, the AC was way louder than it normally would be. But still, on the two episodes after that, they, I still feel like the AC was kind of loud. Not loud, but it was noticeable. At least if you're listening for it, you hear it. That bothers me. I'd rather just be hot, personally, than it mess with the audio. But anyways, I, I, got, I got this heat. And that episode, all that camera movement, my head's about to explode. I'm feeling like John right now. Of all every storyline going on right now, there are certain emotions with all the storylines going on. Cersei, it's uh, not elation, but it's very... I don't feel bad for it. I'm very content with what's going on there. Marjorie, Sir Loris, curious. Curious on what's going to happen next. Baelish anticipation Jon Snow non-stop action I'm uh, excited excited the, see, the stuff with Sansa and Ramsay stress just stress and disgust Tyrion any scene with Tyrion happiness <laughs> yeah, any scene with Jorah Marmont disappointment <laughs> this, this, this disappointment oh man she don't want you and you're gonna die anyway you really love her that bad oh my gosh i mean hey if you hey love is love real talk love is love but you're gonna fight for oh man hey ladies get you a man like sir jorah well i guess it that that means he would end up betraying you and never confess but hey what <laughs> he, he, but he came back. Uh, no, whatever. <laughs> but real talk, it's a good show, man. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. What episode am I on? Episode eight. I might have to finish it out. It's only eight o'clock at night. I might have to finish the show out or the the season out. The Death of the Dragons. Uh, we we gonna get into it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Keep your head up. Peace. of the shadow of death and I fear no evil because I'm blind to it all